Recording. What's up, guys? Welcome to uh, our first mukbang. I'm Johnny the Boy Wonder, and I'm here with my girlfriend Maria. She's been asking me to do a mukbang. <laughs> like, who do you watch? Um, I watch Kimmy, and she does mukbangs with her husband. So, might as well. Might as well. <laughs> with this quarantine. With this quarantine thing, I mean, might as I well. Mean, what can we do? For real. We were trying to vlog, but it started raining. Anyways, what do we got here, babe? So we got the Big Dipper. From and Pizza Hut. it comes Hut. with four sauces. I think these two are just marinara. But it comes with honey barbecue and ranch. And you got yourself a... Oh, I got a Pepsi Cherry. Nice. And of course, I'm gonna go with the Diet Coke. Let's the start. I'm hungry. I'm gonna open this up first. Damn, that's that some ASMR shit. For real. So satisfying. Oh, this barbecue. Is... I don't have a cup. I'm not that fancy. But, uh, oh, the barbecue smells so good. The main reason I didn't want to do a mukbang is because I eat super fast. And I don't think I can talk and eat at the same time. I'm just like. You know, just eating. Yeah. But I'm gonna start because you're, you're lagging me with that soda. I want this mm. piece. Oh my god. That's good. Super I good. I never thought about. I mean. Mm hmm I like it. With the barbecue. It has a bomb crunch too. Mm hmm Are you the type of person that that hates double dippers? Oh. Mm hmm I don't know. So? There's an entire episode on um, Seinfeld about that. <laughs> I never watched that. Though. It's so funny. Like I watched maybe an episode or so, but I never like stuck through it. Like, oh, Seinfeld's on, I gotta watch it. That's a good show. Like, you can watch any episode, and you don't really have to know like what's going on. Mm -hmm. By the because way, every episode is just about something ridiculous. Yeah. By the way, Pizza Hut hooked us up with a ton of paper. I feel like they're like. Hey, here, we gotta support the community with this paper, man. It's paper crisis. Like, there's an episode where he goes to a bookstore. Mm hmm. I don't remember the name of the guy. It's not the main guy, but the main guy's friend. The guy with the glasses. Mm hmm. He goes into a bookstore and he takes a book into <clears throat> the bathroom. What the? To read it. He's going, mm -hmm. and he puts it back. But then they get he gets caught. They're like, oh uh, no, sir, you have to pay for that. Like you took it into the bathroom. <laughs> so they make him buy it. But it becomes like this whole big deal. Mm -hmm. Because he's like, I didn't want to buy it. You know, he's like trying to return it. Mm -hmm. So he's like trying to return it a different day. But then it's been like labeled like in the bathroom. So he can't return it. It's oh, I mean, that's pretty nasty. Like, imagine they did that right now. You were asking about the library, right? It was gonna be open. Imagine mm -hmm. someone took a, a freaking book to the bathroom. Damn. <clears throat> Let's try some of the, the marinara sauce. I'm already on my third piece, babe. I just finished one. No that, way. That's what I'm talking about. Like, I eat fast. Oh, man. Hell yeah. No, I think I've already had two. I don't know. Maybe it was one. Yeah, I see. One, two, three. I don't know. The marinara is freaking bomb. The marinara is always good. I never thought I would record myself eat. 
kind of weird. <laughs> so yesterday, we tried to record a mukbang, and we recorded it. So I'm all happy. I'm like, yeah, like we did awesome questions. We had a like sick conversation. I go to upload the the file to my computer, and then the file's corrupted, and I'm like. What the hell, man? Oh no! I think that's the the one thing you gotta keep in mind when you record with a with a big camera, because I never heard of files being corrupted with a phone. So today we are make sure it's recording. Uh, we're recording with the phone. I know, but make sure. Let me check. Yep, okay. <clears throat> we're good. One of the things we were talking about yesterday was uh, how did we meet? Like, oh yeah. We met on Tinder. <laughs> That's funny. Yeah, but explain to them what happened. Like mm. Backstory. How'd you get on we Tinder? Met. How'd you get on Tinder? Why were the, What the hell were you doing on Tinder? I was single. I was single. I was at. I was going to Cal State Dominguez Hills. My friend told me like, just do it. Like they're single, go on some dates and we. People. I'm not. I'm not even gonna ask how many dates. <clears throat> <laughs> yeah. So we met on Tinder, and every time we think about it, there was no way we were gonna meet. Mm-hmm. Like there is absolutely no way we were gonna meet. We didn't have any otherwise. mutual friends. Mm-hmm. My schedule yeah. was stupid, so I wasn't really meeting people. Besides on Tinder. And you were at school, so... I was going to be working and doing school. That was pretty much my life. Yeah, there's no way we're going to meet. And on the weekends, like... Yeah, I would go out with like my college friends, but I don't, just don't think our paths would ever... Our paths would crossed. have crossed, yeah. yeah. Like, it's funny. What did you tell your parents about us? Like, oh yeah, I met them more. I think it's a lot of men to a friend. Or to school or something. Mm-hmm. I told my mom I, I met you on Facebook. Mm-hmm. And then I was like, yeah, she on goes to... Face? In El Face? Yeah, la conocí en El Face. <laughs> she's a friend of a friend and I just started talking to her. And she's like, okay. Yeah. Because I didn't want to explain what Tinder was. Yeah, like, like I don't want to explain. Like, oh, I'm... And then, then they'd be like... Are you doing that? Like, are you just meeting random people online? Yeah. It's like they don't need to know. Yeah. I mean, now that they're watching this, they'll probably look it up. Cause I know your mom watches my videos. How did your mom meet that dude on Facebook? Huh? Not Facebook. They were asking me. Hmm? They were asking me. Oh, how? how? They're like, how did they meet? And I was like. You know what? I don't know, but I'm pretty sure online on Facebook. Well, no shit, everyone does. Yeah. Because they're still thinking old school, like you go to a bar or you go somewhere, you meet someone and you start talking. Like, there's no time for that now, man. Like, there's too many steps. And we could just get on Tinder and just skip. Talking about meeting on Tinder, I feel like it's a little embarrassing, but at this point, like, it's like whatever. Yeah. Like sometimes they're like, "How do you guys meet?" And I'm like, it's "Like Tinder." <laughs> mm-hmm. What'd you think about me when you met me? You seem like a nice guy. Really. Mm-hmm. That was it. I just had to be a nice dude. <laughs> yeah, what do you mean? See you guys, you could be nice and you could get a girl. No, well, on the first day, I'm just like... <clears throat> like, first day for me is not enough. Well, yeah, me neither. I don't, I don't really think too much about someone the first time I meet them. I mean, we, we met. And then it took months before we like hung out a second time. Yeah. And then once we did start hanging out, 
it took another couple of months before it became official. Mm-hmm. And yeah, like I wasn't gonna just like, rush it or anything. Yeah, I mean, There's no point in rushing. We're both not the type to just like jump into something. So we just took our time to really like figure out where I was gonna go. I mean, she was. Well, I told her, like, I'm not, I'm not ready to be in a relationship. And then she said, Yeah, me neither. Mm-hmm. But then it got to a point where she's like, Nah, I can't just leave it like this. Like, we need some space because I'm gonna develop feelings. Remember that? <laughs> she I was like, told no. them, Yeah, I was like, let's just take some space, mm-hmm. some time apart. My babe. But then the next day. It was not the next day. Yes, it no, was. It, wasn't. it was. It was not the next day. I know perfectly. It wasn't the next day. It was like two or three days later. It was the same week. So what happened was, she wanted space, and I'm like, okay, let's have space. I already knew what what she meant. You know, like I already knew, like in my head, I'm like, okay, because I'm feeling the same way. I'm like, like it was a fork on the road, right? Yeah. Like. If I let this die out and give her her space, like that was gonna be it. And so I was thinking about it, thinking about it. It wasn't the next day, babe, because I was thinking. I was, Either way, it was soon <clears throat> after. I, I knew exactly what I, I was doing. I told you things and you don't remember. Mm-mm. I'm not saying I'm fly, because I'm not. Like I told, like you did this, and you're like, I would never do that. I'm like, yes, you, well, you did it. No, I wouldn't. <clears throat> yeah, you did, babe. No, I wouldn't. Babe, I you I'm, did do things babe, that, that you thought you wouldn't do, but you did do it. I did hit you up. But I'm talking about certain things, like you thought you you wouldn't do uh, it, but you I did. I wouldn't do, do things. things, babe. <laughs> um, yeah, so we got to that fork in the road. I hit her up. The conversation started picking back up, and then it started. We just kept going, right? Like it took another couple of months after that to actually get together, because we're like, okay, we're attracted to each other, we care about each other. Now let's let's see if it actually goes into the relationships direction, and it did. So now we're uh, three years together. Yeah. <laughs> What did you think about my about my uh, pursuit on making online content? Man, I thought it was cool. I could tell that you really enjoy it. I'm enjoying the pizza. How do you feel about um, coming out on my on my channel? I just feel like if you want me to come out, I'll come out. I mean, we all have our insecurities, but I'm just like, this is me, and I'm not gonna worry about what other people think. Freaking pizza is awesome. Yeah, this is good. Are you gonna get animal coffee? Mm-mm. <clears throat> nah, fuck that. I never played any of the animal crossing. Just because it's like the hype game right now? No, I'm not gonna buy it. I actually. I actually put away my Xbox. Like. I really want to focus on my videos and I'm trying to limit the amount of distractions. So I put away my Xbox. I actually canceled my Xbox Gold. You canceled it? I canceled it. I'm serious that about that it. That means ne- neither of us can play online. That's true. But you don't even play. But. When do you play? I thought you were doing. Isn't it a yearly thing? 
No. No, I've been paid monthly. How much is it monthly? Like, um, I think it's like 10 bucks or 20 bucks. That's a lot, no? I thought it was 60 a year. Yeah, if you buy it the whole year. Because $10 a month, that's a lot. Times 12? No, I don't think it's 60 a year. I mean, it could be. I'm not sure. I'm just like... Unless it went up, I don't know. I haven't bought... I haven't paid for it since... Yeah, since we linked our Xboxes. Yeah. So that was like three years ago? Mm-hmm. I wanna... I mean, I still have a bunch of subscriptions that I don't really use. So I'm like slowly checking them out. Like, I have a Gold's Gym membership, <clears throat> but then, but then, um, I also have an LA Fitness membership that I haven't canceled, that I was going to go canceled, but the gym's closed, so I can't physically go and get it canceled. And they're just so dumb online, like, it says you have to, uh, print out a cancellation form and all this crap. I'm like, no. Nah. I can just email them. I'll do that because I'm trying to get a membership at Metroflex. The homie and I want to uh, try out that gym. And then, yeah, there's no point in having LA Fitness. My favorite is the <clears throat> barbecue sauce. For real? Yeah. Nah, I'm enjoying the marinara more. So how are you dealing with the quarantine? What are you going to do all day? Luckily. I'm still working, so I just keep praying that the work continues until. I mean, you know, I don't think you guys would be shut down. Nah, we we do essential work, so mm -hmm. we're good. I mean, it kind of sucks because I have all this free time on, so it's like it's, stay home. It's not to have fun, which is boring. Which is yeah, it's boring. Good catch up on show. We're currently catching up on Arcos. She hasn't seen it. And I'm waiting for her to catch up so I can watch the latest season of Narcos. But it's taking a minute. You can watch that. They make you feel so um, attached to them. Yeah. Well that's what they do, like like some people were talking shit about Sons of Anarchy because this show makes you feel a certain way for the characters. But then they're doing like really evil shit, like killing people, and you're just like, like really, like I'm feeling bad for this guy that just killed so many. I mean, I still love Sons of Anarchy, and I've rewatched that thing like so many times. I want her to watch Prison Break with me. That show was super cool. That was a show that like I was really into before any other show. I think. I want to watch Kingdom. What about Inuyasha? Oh, that too, but I want to watch Kingdom. It's like a Korean zombie show. And it's like seasons? Yeah. I think season three just came out. Nice. Damn, I'm stuffed. I'm <laughs> so too. stuffed. But I will be streaming. You said it, right? Hmm? <clears throat> you said it. I didn't say anything. Wednesday and Thursday. Oh, but you stream. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, because she loves me so much that I can't stream for so long. <laughs> so she's like, well, I'm going to be busy Wednesday and Thursday. So I'm like, all right, I'll stream Wednesday and Thursday. So, yeah, I don't know if I'll be playing, like, online games. I really want to play all the single player games that, like, I have piled up. Mm -hmm. So I think that that's what I'll be streaming. So Wednesdays and Thursdays. After 4 p.m. I can't say 4 p.m. on the dot. I think at 6 p.m. Pacific Standard Time, I'll be streaming. And uh, the videos, I'm trying to make all the videos come out like at least every Sunday. And at least once a week, actually. And I think that's about it. That was cool. I'm full. Yeah. Interesting. 
interesting mukbang thing. This is our first mukbang. If you want to see more, or you want to see us eat something else, like what, what are you craving? Mm -hmm. I, I can't think of anything right now, but that's why they tell us. Mm, okay. Yeah, so let us know what you want us to, to eat next. I'm thinking Don's or... Um, or Tom's chicken plate. Or the Tom's chicken plate. That's super bomb. Mm -hmm. Or Gus Burger. That's like our local, not our local now, but that was the local burger spot we would always go to. Mm, yeah. I think super bomb. Super bomb. Favorite. Cash only. That's true. It's cash only. Uh, that's it, right? I think this is gonna be it. So like, subscribe. If if some strange reason this comes out on Instagram or IGTV. Head over to my YouTube channel and come watch my content. I'll see you guys later. Peace. Out.